and ready to stake his claim atop WWE. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. Cody, I will never forget the night that you and I had the opportunity to call this man's amazing return to WWE. You're right about that, Saxton. A true WrestleMania moment, if there ever was one. A man who began his WWE career with a legacy to uphold, but soon became a star who left them all in the dust. Yeah, I think we can all agree his time away has turned him into one of the toughest competitors in all of sports entertainment. The animal has been unleashed. And his opponent from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds. A former WWE Champion, a Royal Rumble winner, a man who has main evented WrestleMania. And now Batista simply demands that the WWE Universe give him what he wants. I do not envy the task at hand for this superstar. You are facing a man with all the momentum in the world in Cody Rhodes. Watching this no DQ match, I can't help but think of all the great no disqualification matches we've seen in WWE over the years. Don Michael, Triple H versus Brock Lesnar in 2013, The Rock versus Mankind in 1999, both classics. But the all-time best has got to be Undertaker versus Shawn Michaels at WrestleMania 26. Yeah, I hate to disagree with you, Corey, but Stone Cold Steve Austin against The Rock at WrestleMania 17 was the greatest no disqualification match of all time. In fact, it might even be the greatest match in WWE history. Let's just agree that all of those matches are great, and I'd argue this one could live up to that same hype, guys. Now, this is the kind of match where you can really push the bounds of damage you can inflict. I'm not saying that a no disqualification match should mean carte blanche to do whatever you want to someone, but it does provide an opening to be creative in your offense. So be creative. And there was some force on that move. Match ending power. Just continuing to dismantle their opponent. Oh, uh, stop right to the gut. Watch out! They're coming towards the announce desk. What the hell are you doing, Byron? And now thrown back into the ring. Big red here. Here's a cover. A kick out at the last possible moment. Woo, that was close.
Not even a near fall there. Boy, what a kick. Batista finds the advantage. Ooh, clothesline delivered. Cody Rhodes rallying up the crowd like only a Rhodes can. And an inverted atomic drop. was definitely not thinking about finesse with that one. Was only thinking about dominance. This could do it! Power right out in one. Showing his determination there with that kick out. Vicious right for him. Uh-oh. This isn't going to be pretty. Suplex! He's looking a little off balance. Oh, torturous knee. And now Batista's being dismantled. Yeah, Cody Rhodes is clearly in control. Time now for Batista to get his energy and claw back into the fight. Cody's cut open. But I think he's in his element, guys. Uh-oh, double underhook. This is gonna be nasty. Butterfly pile driver! We've seen how damaging pile drivers can be, and that one looked particularly painful. Russian leg sweep. And he goes for the pin. Only a one count before the kick out. That's still a quick kick out at this point. He just barely dodges. Setting up. Nice suplex. Vertical suplex. Oh my God. Oh, what a slap. That's Disrespect. A no respect at all with that action. But it can also be meant to antagonize. Could be a method of luring your opponent into a mistake. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Oh, suicide dive! Cody is picking the opposition apart. Batista looks to have been well scouted. He's got him scouted! Batista finding a way to slow his opponent's assault down. Now's a chance for Batista to get back into this match. To a shot block, debilitating counter. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Cody Rhodes. Burner breaker. Batista sides it. Oh, disturbing impact. He's just being taken full advantage of now. Rhodes is unloading offense here. Evading offense. Gonna carry the around back spot to be in. Here's some left Taking it outside the ring now. He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. He's back into the ring. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? Military press! Ooh. He's getting pushed down into the defensive. The animal's been grinding his teeth all night. That was an indication that he's ready to feast now. Into the ring again. Rose looking to end this. Will Batista recover? For the win! There's two! Batista just survived the best shot he's going to receive all night. I don't think there's any stopping the animal. You got to wonder what more Cody has to do to put him away here. Rolling into a monkey flip. You have to think these competitors expected this to be a difficult challenge. Even so, at this stage, things just get more and more dangerous. Fatigue starts setting in, and you don't know exactly how long your wits about you. It could quickly lead to error. <laughs> He was elusive. Dominating shoulder tackle. And Batista gets warded off. Oh, catapulting down on the opponent. He's just getting beaten at all fronts here. Might want to walk it off or shake it off or do whatever he needs to do to get his head in the hole being ended here. Kicks out. He still has life. He just won't give up. There. Looks under. Let's go behind. German suplex turns the ties. Uh 
Uh-oh. Elbow drop. Ooh. How in the world do these superstars have anything left at this point? The arena's thinking the same thing. All eyes are focused on this moment. Taking a trip outside, he's got to be mindful of the count. Oh, Cody anticipated that. Quick exchange, reversing the reversal. Oh, the sledgehammer connects. That'll scramble your insides. Every successive move is putting the opponent in a dicey situation. Oh, this is bad, guys. Batista is bleeding. one matchup that lived up to its billing and then some.
but you can't deny that the earlier distraction had catastrophic repercussions throughout the match.